Latinos, Hispanics are almost 20% of the United States. The median age of Latinos is a decade younger than the median age of Americans as a whole. We're still a young electorate. We're still a growing electorate. We're just starting to see it. You're a reporter and you've lost your curiosity. Get out of the business, okay? You should always be curious. The reporters, the producers, editors fail to do their homework. We're living off stereotypes, assumptions. How do you currently, as individuals, balance uh, being yourself while also handling that responsibility of representing the Latinx community when it's so diverse? You no, know, it's not like you have to be a Latino to cover the Latino community. Um, nobody is saying that, um, but it helps when you have that diversity because then you recognize nuance. I want to start with politics, though, because it is one of the bigger sticking points that we see when it comes to covering Latinos in news. Who votes less? Young people. Who votes less? People with fewer years of education. Who votes less? People with lower annual incomes. So if you have a disproportionately working class, disproportionately young vote, well, yeah, it's, it's going to vote in a different way from America as a whole. I do fear that we're still not seen as good enough, that we are a checklist item, and we are the American experience. And the fact that we're still having this conversation in 2021 is just mind boggling. If you are in journalism, make sure that you don't get carried away by stereotypes and misrepresentations and make sure that you do your research. If you have the opportunity and you're in school and your school has, you know, whatever kind of a, of a media program, radio, TV, newspaper, join. 